Here we are at American Crime, uh, and you're here uh, representing uh, Valentine's Day. That's right. You know what it was uh, criminal about it is it was the story. The story of Valentine's Day is the two stories of two guys. They were each called Valentine, and they fell in love with each other. And this was in the Roman times, and being gay wasn't cool. And they actually uh, killed him. And uh, so when you're when you're actually killed for love. You're, it's a story, a Valentine story. It's like worse than Ro Ro Romeo and Juliet because there's two gay guys and they got killed uh, because they were in love. And it's a really sad story and I don't know why we celebrate it. And how do you know this? Uh, because I read history. I, I, I'm really smart and I have a uh, very high IQ and I read a lot and I read a history book all about this. I have a 96% reading comprehension rate. If I read it, it must be true. And if you said it, it must be true. Yes, if I said it, it must be true. And yet you are the master of liars, so it must be true. Uh, I have impersonated liars, but I'm not a natural born liar. That's what you think. <laughs> <laughs> the jury is in on that one too. So yeah. tell me about why should we celebrate the, the crime of Valentine? Well, we, we shouldn't actually be doing it. Actually, it should be celebrated in the village. You know, in the village, they got a lot of gay people and they're really out, they're out and about. And, uh, um, and they should be talking about this, but uh, they don't really talk about it. And now all the straight people have stolen their holiday. How do you think they, they would feel about it if they knew? Most gay people don't even know the story of Valentine's. They're just crazy about that guy. <laughs> Uh, uh, I think that guy had a little bit much to drink, don't you? Yes.